In this Camera RC Deluxe tutorial, we are going to take a tour of the light table feature. Notice that the light table for comparing images is only available in our professional edition. The light table is used to compare multiple images in Camera RC Deluxe. We open the light table by selecting one or more images in the thumbnail viewer and then right clicking on one of the selected images. This will open a context menu from which Compare Images is selected. The light table will open. Notice that this can take some time to open depending on your computer and the hard drive speed. Once the images are opened, they are displayed in small windows, also shown as a thumbnail display of all images being compared. The number of images compared can be changed from 1 to 4 using the buttons in the toolbar. The zoom in and zoom out buttons are used to zoom the image. The plus and minus keys on the keyboard can also be used for zooming. When the zoom lock is set, all images zoom together. Turning off the zoom lock allows individual images to be zoomed. There are several selections under the zoom selector. The fit image fits the image to the current viewer window. The fit width fits the images to the width of the window, cropped as needed, while the height fits the images to the height of the windows. The actual size zooms the images to 100%. Use the zoom slider to set any zoom amount. You can use a slider or just enter a percentage to zoom. Most zoom operations can also be done using the keyboard. For example, I'll use the asterisk key to zoom fit. Previously captured images can be displayed by using the Open Files icon. When the selector opens, select one or more images to open. The selected images will be displayed in the light table thumbnails and can be selected for viewing. Use the next and previous buttons to move to different images or just click on the thumbnail to display. The currently selected image will be highlighted in the thumbnails and also highlighted around its window border. When a different image is selected for viewing, it will replace the currently selected image. The pan lock control is used to lock the images together when zoomed and panning. When the pan lock is disabled, only the image being panned will move. You pan images by left clicking the mouse on the image and moving the images with the mouse. The image properties are displayed below each image. Click on the properties button to display or hide the image properties being displayed. The image properties displayed can be changed by clicking on the Property Settings button. When the Property Settings opens, the properties to be displayed can be selected. In addition to the properties, the name of the property can be displayed. Here we show the properties displayed without the property names included. We'll switch back and show it with the property names displayed. The histogram button is used to display or hide the histogram display that is beneath the image as well. Change the histogram color being displayed using the drop down menu on the histogram button. Use the help button on the toolbar to open the help for the light table. Below each image is a set of controls for that image. There is a save button a Next and Previous button, and a Zoom In and Zoom Out button. The Delete button is used to delete the image from the light table and also deletes the image from the computer hard drive. I'll select the image previously added to the light table and I'll delete that image. The Remove button removes the image from the light table but does not delete the image from the hard drive itself. Use the Mark button to mark an image and its thumbnail. The mark will be remembered when we leave the light table. Click on the Save button to save the selected image to a new location. Enter the name to which you want to save the file and click Save. When we close the light table, we see that the marked image is shown in the thumbnails. This concludes our tour of the light table in Camera RC Deluxe.